This video is made possible by Clove Technology. Visit clove.co.uk to pick up the Sony Xperia Z2 and other devices SIM free. What's up YouTube, Saf here on Super Saf TV. And in this video, I'm gonna be doing a benchmark and speed comparison between the Sony Xperia Z2 and the iPhone 5S. So we'll start off with a boot test, then we'll do a benchmark test, followed by some app tests or browser tests and some popular apps to see the differences in speed between these two devices. So kicking off with a boot test, powering both of these devices up at the same time to see which one powers up first. So we'll speed this process up a little bit just so we don't bore you. And let's see which one boots up first. We see that the iPhone 5S did boot up first, at roughly about 28 seconds it took. The Sony Xperia Z2 just came in a few seconds after, at roughly about 31 seconds. Now moving on to a benchmark test, I know a lot of people like seeing benchmark differences, so we'll use Geekbench 3, which is available on both devices. And the iPhone 5S did complete the benchmark test first at roughly about 29 seconds. The Sony Xperia Z2 followed at roughly about 51 seconds. So it did take quite a bit longer for the Sony Xperia Z2 to finish the benchmark test. Now, although the single core score for the iPhone 5S is higher, because it has a dual core processor compared to the quad core processor of the Sony Xperia Z2, the Sony Xperia Z2 does have a higher multi-core score. So overall, it does have a higher score. Now doing a browser test, we're using Safari on the iPhone 5S and Chrome on the Sony Xperia Z2. So we'll use The Verge as an example because that's a nice heavy website to test out. And pressing both at the same time, we can see that the Sony Xperia Z2 does start showing the content first and both are still loading. We can see that they're wearing away at the top. There's a blue bar on the Sony Xperia Z2 and there's that little circle loading icon on the iPhone 5S. And both of them are finished loading at pretty much exactly the same time. So I'm gonna call that a draw. Now moving down and checking out the full Verge website, which is very, very heavy and has lots of content. If we click them both at the same time, we can see that once again, we start seeing the content first on the Sony Xperia Z2. But in terms of load times, if we still look at the top constraint there, the Sony Xperia Z2 does finish first. We can see that the iPhone 5S is still loading up a little bit. Now moving on to an article, so we'll open the same article on both devices at the same time and see which one comes up first. So both have been clicked and you can see once again that the Sony Xperia Z2 does start displaying the content first. But in terms of loading, again concentrating at the top, looking at both of these, and we can see that they were pretty much neck and neck there once again. So in terms of browser speeds, I think they are pretty much neck and neck. The Xperia Z2 did win in terms of the full Verge website, it did completely finish loading it a little bit quicker. But in terms of scrolling and zooming, both of these are pretty much neck and neck, very, very close here. Now moving on to a popular app, so we'll try Instagram, so pressing it both at the same time. We start seeing the content on the iPhone 5S first, but they pretty much finish loading at exactly the same time. So that's pretty much a tie there once again. Now moving on to some content. So just browsing through the app, checking out some images and things. We can see that again, neck and neck, very, very close here. It's very hard to tell if there's any difference whatsoever. Now finally trying out a game. So Temple Run 2 is a game that's available on both devices. So opening the game up on both devices at the same time, we can see that the iPhone 5S does load up the game a little bit quicker compared to the Sony Xperia Z2, just a few split seconds, very close once again, but the iPhone 5S did load it up quicker. So there we have it, the speed test between the Sony Xperia Z2 and the iPhone 5S, very, very close here. The iPhone 5S did boot up quicker and it did load up the game ever so slightly quicker as well. But in terms of the benchmark, the Sony Xperia Z2 did score higher. And in terms of the browser on app test, they were pretty much neck and neck, very, very close. Although the Sony Xperia Z2 did load up the full website a little bit quicker. So realistically speaking, between these two, you're not really gonna be noticing much of a difference in terms of speed. Both are very, very fast and some of the fastest devices out there at the moment. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. If you did, as always, please do hit that thumbs up button for me. It really does help me out. And why not subscribe to the channel? I've got plenty more content coming up on here. Thanks for watching, this is Saf on Super Saf TV, and I'll see you next time. If you wanna see more regular videos like this one, then be sure to hit the subscribe button, which will be below. If you're on a mobile device, it may be somewhere else. If you wanna see my previous related video, then hit the link right here. If you wanna stay in touch over Facebook, Twitter, and Google+, then all of the addresses will be there somewhere, as well as direct links in the description below. Okay, if you're still watching, then that means you've not done one of those things, so. No. Yeah. 
anyway, um, I'm just I'm just gonna go um, downstairs. See. Okay. Um, th there isn't really a downstairs. Anyway. So yeah.